Welcome to Finished Work International Ministries, a ministry that is on the cutting edge, changing lives around the world. As you let God in today and apply the word, expect a divine encounter and supernatural transformation. It is impossible for you to be defeated when you have the revelation of the will of God. It is impossible for situations to subdue you when you walk in understanding of what God is saying to you. Let the finished work of Jesus determine what you pray. When God is your source, you don't look back. You keep looking forward. You keep trusting. Him. God, I trust you. Here's Apostle Faith Man Obuena. Glory be to God. You're welcome to pray and prophesy to your day. You know, the scripture said, This is the day the Lord has made, or we'll rejoice and be glad. And God wants us to see great things every day of our lives. So we wake up with an expectation that miracles will happen today. We we'll wake up with an expectation that we're going to experience preferential treatment today. You see, your expectation is important if you're going to have a great day. Never expect that today will be like yesterday. Expect that today will be better than your yesterday. As we pray and prophesy, have an expectation for the manifestation of supernatural assistance that you will receive supernatural assistance to move in the direction of the will of God. Expect good news today. Expect greater results today. That something amazing is going to happen today. You know, if the scripture have said this is the day the Lord has made, I want to see it as the day of my harvest, the day of my increase. So I have an expectation. And I want you to have an expectation as we pray. Oh, Mandres Ketoli Pasho Kotoli Bradese Ketoli Blakamaba. Lord will lift you high. Lord will give you praise for this day. We thank you because you're a faithful God. According to your word, they that do know their God, they'll be strong and they will do exploits. We are going to see supernatural exploits. In supernatural exploits, we will do amazing things today with the gift of time, with every resources that you have entrusted to us. In the name of Jesus. Let the scripture established in Psalm 23, verse 1. The psalmist said, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. So today you will not want. He therefore what to take care of your family, he therefore what to pay your bills with, maybe to pay your bills, you will not be in want. He said, I shall not want. Because when God is your source, he will consistently bring you direction, provision, and protection. When God is your source, he will bring you protection, provision, and direction. When he's your source, Father, in the name of Jesus, we'll pray for everyone that is connected to this broadcast right now. That you exceed their provision. You exceed their provision. I pray that your expectation will come into manifestation. Whatever you are believing God for today, may you see supernatural relief supernatural assistance uh, manifestation that will exceed your imagination, that will exceed your thinking will prophesy to this day it will be a stress-free day. It will be a worry-free day. Likata prato seketo likababa. Rindro sokoto lobo shakata libra to seketo libla kababa. Melingranto sokoto libra desketo libla seketo libla kababa. Rindro sokoto libra desketo libla kababa. In the name of Jesus, in Jeremiah chapter one. In Jeremiah chapter one, I like to read. Thank you, Holy Spirit. 
in Jeremiah chapter 1, I want to read verse 10. See, I have, I have this day said thee over the nation. God has sent you over the nations, over resources, over open doors. You have been sent over the nations, over resources. So as you step out for your business today, or if you're ready in your business place, expect amazing open doors. Expect amazing open doors. We prophesy that today there'll be an amazing open doors, preferential treatment. Amazing release of the spirit. In the name of Jesus, God has sent you over the kingdoms to root out whatever that is not consistent with the will of God for your life will root it out in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray right now in the name of Jesus, whatever that is not in line with your will in the life of this person that is watching this broadcast will root it out in the name of Jesus. Whatever that is not planted by the Heavenly Father be rooted out. Every form of confusion, distraction, manipulation, deception, wickedness, affliction will command you to be rooted out right now in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. I'd like to look at this scripture in Psalm 1. Thank you, Holy Ghost. In Psalm 1. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Start your day with an expectation that God is going to do something amazing today for you. Always start your day with expectation that this is the day to be death free. This is the day to break out of limitation, out of any opposition that may be contending with the manifestation of your God given destiny. Now, watch this in Psalm 1. It said, Blessed is the man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standeth in the way of sinners. He said, Blessed is that man. So, we're going to pray this morning, Lord. We'll make the decision to flow according to your word. That today you are going to walk according to the word of God. You are going to function according to his word. You are going to think according to his word. We make the decision to function according to your word today. Your decision this morning is that you will function according to the word of God today. Like Jesus said, if you continue in my word, you'll be my disciples indeed. That today, in your place of work, in your business place, in that marketplace, you will continue in the word of God. We will continue in the word. In our motive, in our action, in our thoughts, in our lifestyle, in our communication, in our expression. We will continue in your word in the name of Jesus. Every form of destruction will bind it in the name of Jesus. We will continue in God's word in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now, in Psalm 1 verse 2, it says, But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and in the Lord does he meditate day and night. I'm going to pray right now that meditation of God's word will be our way of life. You know, some people can meditate on God's word. That meditating on God's word, thinking about it, thinking about God's word, will be our way of life. If you think from the word of God, your action will reflect his word. If you think from God's word, this is the benefit of meditation, that your action reflect the word of God. That is the purpose of meditation.
conversation. So let lift up your voice right now. Rekudu basuka da blade se kamalababa. Lord, as we think from your word, as we meditate on your word, we receive revelation to deal with any situation. We receive revelation to make right decision. We receive revelation to move in the direction of your will. Manduba sakaliba grido so kamalababa. Melego so kambra te se ketolibla kamaba. We receive revelation to build according to your counsel, according to your purpose, according to your will. Manduba so kambra te se kabida. Melengra do so kapaprin do so kalimbra do se kababa. In the name of Jesus, badumbra ta su katipa pronto sa kababa. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, verse 3 said, Psalm 1, verse 3. He said, And he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of waters. This is who you are. The tree planted by the rivers of water. The tree planted. Hallelujah. This is how your business is. He said, And it shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bringeth forth bringeth forth his fruit in his season and his leave his leave his leave also shall not wither and whatsoever he doeth shall prosper hallelujah whatsoever he doeth shall prosper in the name of jesus we prophesy that whatsoever we do it according to the word of god will prosper whatsoever we do it according to your will according to your word it will prosper that business, that company, that job will stand right now and declare that it will prosper beyond every limitation, beyond every imagination. It shall prosper. In the name of Jesus, look at that scripture, Psalm 1, verse 3. And he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water, because he has been meditating on God's word. Because he has he has refused to keep company with the ungodly, because he has refused to function in the flesh, and because he's meditating on the word of God and his action proceed from God's word. Verse 3 said, And he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bringeth forth his fruits in his season. I prophesy that from this day forward, you're going to bring forth fruit. In the name of Jesus, may this business, may this job bring forth fruit in the mighty name of Jesus. We'll prophesy right now. That this job will bring forth fruit, will bring forth testimony, will bring forth finances, this business, this job. Whatever you do, what you have laid your hands to do according to the word of God, it will bring forth in the name of Jesus. Mm. He's bringing forth fruit right now. He's bringing forth fruit right now. He's bringing forth fruit in the name of Jesus. He's bringing forth fruit with prophesy. Amazing fruit is coming out of your life in this season. It's coming out of your destiny. You will bear fruit and it will show. You will produce fruit and it will be visible in the name of Jesus, I see some fruit coming. I see more fruit coming. And I see all fruit coming. Some fruits are coming. Some fruits are coming. They are coming in today. Some fruits, will, more fruit will come in within the day. And all the fruits will begin to come in before the end of the day. I prophesy that into your life. I prophesy amazing release of supernatural help. We prophesy 
sight to our day that today is the day the Lord has made and prayers will be answered. Expectation will come in. Dreams will come into manifestation. Visions that you have five years ago, 20 years ago, 25 years ago will call those visions into existence. The vision to build mega companies, mega businesses, the vision to travel, to reach out to people, the vision to partner with ministries in millions of dollars in pounds. I prophesy every vision they will have expression. Your life will not be endangered. Your destiny will not be endangered. Your fruit will not be endangered. Bakuba 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 Basuta Papusa Kabaduga Melenkretos of Koto Brante Sekaba. It shall not be endangered. In the name of Jesus, I prophesy. Mighty help of the Spirit. 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 In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus. In Psalm 23, verse 1. Verse 2, sorry. Psalm 23, verse 2, he said, He maketh me to lie down in green pasture. I prophesy, you will come into your green pasture, Mandros Kotolibaba, a place of prosperity, joy, and increase. Mandubo Shakatali, blah, blah, blah. He maketh me to lie down in green pasture. You will lie down. Your business, your vision, your destiny will be on green pasture. Liba Sukababa. This is the picture of your life. This is the picture of your destiny that you will lie down on green pasture. Malika In the name of Jesus, we prophesy right now. Expansion. He said, He maketh me to lie down in green pasture, but he, he leads me beside the still waters. Verse 3 said, He restored my soul. Right now, pray for restoration. If there is anyone watching this broadcast that you have been broken, You've been hurting, you've been you've been abused one way or the other. I pray for restoration. I pray that things that were taken away from you be supernaturally be restored back into your life, be restored back into your vision, into your assignment. I pray for supernatural restoration. Restoration of opportunity, restoration of divine connection, relationship with potential to accelerate your vision. May they be restored. May they be restored. Restoration of destiny relationship. Divine connection, the right people, the right people, the right people. Lobo shaka baba, lobo lobo shaka daba soko baba, rindo lobo lobo shaka baba, rinde de 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 lobo shoko toli bla kara baba, mbredo tobo shoko toli bla kara baba shaka baba, rindo lobo lobo shoko toli bla kara baba shoko lobo baba, lende lobo shoko toli bla kara baba. In the name of Jesus, supernatural opportunity, supernatural help, supernatural release. Likondo lobo shaka baba. Supernatural opportunity, supernatural release by the Spirit of God. Rindo Sokoto Lobo Shakarababa. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Expect good news today. Yes, that's what I hear in my spirit. Expect good news today. Something good will happen to you today. Expect good news today. Expect some testimonies to come in today. You will be promoted beyond those who have started that job before you. This is what I hear in my spirit right now. You will be promoted to lead those who are walking in that place before you came. There is someone watching me. And that's what the Spirit of God will have me say to you. You'll be promoted. Something is going to happen and it will lead to your promotion. Receive in the name of Jesus. Ooh. <laughs> promotion, you'll be promoted with a new paycheck. This is what I'm seeing the Spirit. You'll be promoted with a new paycheck. Read to show to libra to so 
Thank you, Father. Ooh, my tumbra da 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 ba ba ba. You'll be promoted with a new paycheck. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Receive in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Lord, thank you for ministering to people. Expect supernatural result today. Expect supernatural result today. Expect amazing things to break out because the Holy Ghost has gone ahead of you and you will see amazing release of the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Father. Big things are happening to you now in the name of Jesus. I prophesy that your dreams are coming to pass. I prophesy that your children will walk in the fear of the Lord. In the name of Jesus, I decree and I declare every cloud of darkness, I command it to bow in the name of Jesus. And I speak peace over the atmosphere of your life, over the atmosphere of your destiny. As you step out for your job, for your business today, something good will be happening to you. Goodness and mercy will follow you everywhere you drive to, everywhere you go to, everywhere you step in. Goodness and mercy will follow you all the days of your life in the name of Jesus Amen. If you're watching this broadcast today, this is prayer and prophesy to your day. We're back to it again and the Holy Ghost will be ministering to people with this broadcast. Pray and prophesy to your day. And if you're watching this broadcast today and you don't know Jesus as your Lord and Savior, I'd like you to say this after me. Lord Jesus, I confess with my mouth, I believe in my heart that God have raised Jesus from the dead. Thank you, Father, for saving me. Amen. If you pray this prayer with me, it means you're born again, and the Spirit of God will lead you from this day forward. Now, I want to encourage you to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Our YouTube channel has more than 2,000 videos there that can empower you, share God's Word with you, help you to grow in the things of the Spirit. So, you, you can go to finishworktv.com also to watch our broadcast, finishworktv.com, stream 24-7 helping people around the world to receive the engrafted word of God. And you can never remain the same if you stay connected to what God is doing with those broadcasts and your life will remain the same. If you're watching this broadcast, they want to encourage you to consider partnering with the ministry. You know, partnership is strategic as we take the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ to more people. So together we are changing history and helping more people. So your partnership will be ministering to someone. You know, sometimes when we give for the gospel, we don't know how this broadcast gets to more people in different places that we never thought of. But your our giving will be helping to project the gospel into the hearts of many people around the world. So you can go to finishworktv.com and slash giving and give and the Spirit of God will lead you. You can go to PayPal. It's faithmanteachings at gmail.com. Faithmanteachings at gmail.com. Thank you for being part of this broadcast. Until I come your way soon, please don't forget this. There is greatness in you, and Jesus is coming soon.